Hi, my name is Malcolm Farley and I'm the Senior Director for Marketing and Communications here at Poly Prep. I've been here since 2008. There are amazing things happening every day here at Poly in the classroom, in the science lab, in the art studio, and rehearsal rooms, practice rooms, on the athletic playing fields of the school. And we have the privilege of seeking those stories out, whether it be uh, through narrative writing, through photography, through graphics, through video, and telling those stories. So right now I am drafting an alumni profile on Kyle Winter Stoner, who graduated in 2009. So we did a Skype interview for about 30 minutes. Um, I just asked him questions about uh, his poly experience and his college experience and then his fellowship experience. It was pretty cool. So this article will be published in the Poly Pulse, uh, hopefully sometime soon. So that. Um, well, right now I'm in the archives room and I'm just looking for stuff through all the old boxes, stuff to put in the Poly magazine. Um, well, there's a lot of film negatives. Like this one is from the 90s. It's um, it just shows football and tennis from that time period. And we put photos like this in the magazine to show. You know what Polly used to look like. You're in the advancement office, which consists of the development office and uh, marketing and communications. The Grace Key Society uh, students who volunteer during the academic year, and a small number of them are selected for paid internships during the summer, really help marketing and communications and development with the advancement function of the school. Right now, I am organizing the name tags for a special reunion. I am alphabetizing them and I'm going to put them back in this box so that we can pull the right name out for the right person so that they can proudly show what they look like when they were a poly student. So right now I'm making uh, pie graphs and bar graphs using Excel. And so in the last few weeks a lot of us were looking through emails that were sent by poly and we're finding the percentages that were sent, not sent, and of those that were sent, which ones were opened and not opened. Yeah. Last week we made phone calls to alums who donated to Poly. And we sent them emails and wrote letters thanking them for their generous contribution. So right now I'm editing a video using an application called Final Cut Pro. And since we moved into an office recently, this year with construction and everything, we thought that it'd be a great idea to share with everyone what we do during the school year and in the summer. I just finished working on the new Family Handbook, which is a compilation of policies, expectations, and procedures for pretty much every department in the school. It lets you know everything from attendance policies to dress code, um, athletics, academics, performing arts um, procedures. We've been very privileged in the four years that uh, I've been here and working with Great Key Society students to have some of, I think, our best and brightest kids at Poly, who've just been a lot of fun to be around. I think they've had fun working with us. But we're also really looking for students who are excited by um, what Poly is and can be, and who are willing to learn how we um, work with our, our faculty or our, our academic leadership to ensure that Poly is the best that can be. And my favorite part of Grade Key is interviewing and talking with uh, Poly alumni. One of my favorite interviews that I've done was uh, with the Paul alum, uh, Kate Bernstein, who won a daytime Emmy for her reality show, uh, Mate. I really liked that interview because we, uh, we were both similar in many ways. We were both uh, into journalism and uh, we were both on the uh, student newspaper. Listening to her story taught me a lot about what I had to do to succeed like her. Well, one thing I love about coming to Great Key for the summer is being able to work with my friends um, in a different environment than like a classroom. And also the fact that we get a hands-on experience like in the world of editing and writing. So one of the most memorable parts of working for Great Key has really been the opportunity to understand the world of professional journalism. Great Key has given me the chance to draft my own articles and participate in the crucial process of revision. So from drafting articles and reviewing the revisions, I'm Rebecca Grossfield, the Associate Director of Marketing Communication. I've learned so much about how to write professionally for a publication and I think over the years she's really helped me improve my writing. It's like I think that we were brought here as summer interns to grow the bond between alumni, between people who go to the school now, and between the people who will come to the school later. You know, I just love to see all these smiling faces at me. I loved my peers. I'm sorry that you was leaving. I'm going to miss you. 
And also, uh, my boss, Maria, 